Hey guys, Hacks for Tech here for another video tutorial, and in this video I'm just going to be briefly talking about how you can use the Sony PlayStation Eye camera as a webcam. Alright, so there are a ton of different webcams out there that you can get on Amazon and um, at your local retailers, uh, but the best one that I have found so far in terms of both quality as well as uh, the price is the Sony PlayStation Eye camera. Now I know I've seen other videos online about this, but I wanted to make this video just uh, a very brief video to give some feedback that, uh, that I have on actually using this as a webcam. In addition to giving some feedback on this, I did want to also make sure that you guys have a proper link to the drivers. I saw that on some people's videos, uh, it wasn't very clear, so in the description of this video, I'll make sure that you have a direct link so that you can download the driver and easily use this camera. Okay, so here I have the Amazon page open uh, from where I actually can see that I purchased this webcam, uh, and it's only $7. And even though this is very cheap, once you actually install the drivers to use this on your PC, uh, the video quality is actually very, very good, and the audio quality is really good as well. Uh, so good, in fact, that at my workplace, I actually use this uh, as my main webcam whenever I do video conferencing. So that says something. I actually use it in a business environment, and it works really, really well. I've also found that it's very easy to adjust the webcam as well, so that you can get it to... Uh, view any angle that you want. Now the only criticism that I would have about using this as a webcam uh, is that sometimes uh, because of the fact that the wire can get a little bit tangled, uh, sometimes it can be hard to keep it steady so it might um, move around a little bit when you're trying to to get it to aim at a specific area. So one of the things that I did to get around that was I just got some uh, very simple mounting foam that I put under it uh, so that you can allow it to stay adhered to the desk that you have it on, or if you wanted to affix it to something, uh, you could use some mounting foam to make sure that uh, it can easily be pointed to whatever location that you want it to, to be viewing. But other than that, it's a fantastic webcam to use for uh, whatever purpose that you need it for. Uh, if you go online and you look up other similar webcams, you can see that there are a number of different ones available. Um, they start off usually around the 20-ish dollar range, so you can he see here we have a 1080p recording one, 4K ones that are $192, but myself personally, I really don't use webcams that often. When I do, they're for short web conferences, and I didn't really need anything that was that, was that expensive, so I just decided to go with this route, uh, downloaded the drivers, it only takes a few seconds to set it up, and it provides really, really good results. So I just wanted to make this quick video to uh, to offer this information. So check the video description, it's going to have the link to the drivers that you'll need to download in order to use this webcam with your PC, it works on uh, most Windows versions. Also I'll put a link in the video description to where you can actually buy this webcam uh, or this PlayStation Eye camera. I'll also put a link in the description to the mounting foam that I use to affix it to my desk so that it doesn't move around so much. Alright, and that's it for this quick video tutorial. I mostly just wanted to give some feedback uh, after using this for several months now as my main webcam. Uh, let me know what you guys think. I'd be curious to hear your opinions and if you guys are actually using this, uh, how well it works for you. Alright, that's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in my next video.